as a southeastern Kenya region uh, UDA fraternity and also Kenya Council in large. We just want to do a follow up of a few things. As you all know, uh, the Kamba community has been in the opposition now for the last 15 years. And this is out of uh, being misled by one senior Kamba politician to vote in the wrong direction. In the last election, we voted uh, around 85%, 75% to Raila Odinga and Azimio, which has made us also and has made us head to the opposition. Uh, luckily enough, this time round, when uh, Raila and uh, Azimio went ahead and called for demonstrations, the Kamba community, despite our proximity to the city, we've, uh, dis uh, we've distanced ourselves from the Mandamano. You've seen no Kamba leaders, you've seen no Kamba youth, you've seen no Kamba representation in the demonstrations in Nairobi or in any part of Wukampani. And we want to appreciate our people for that. That should, has also pointed to a new direction where it's very clear that yes, we have followed someone who has uh, lost, who has led us into a losing direction for quite some while. And it has come to a time when we, we, we have to make a decision that uh, enough is enough to follow this person. And uh, it has been evident in uh, this demonstration that except this senior leader from Mukambane, no other leader, no other part of the region, of the Law Eastern region, that is involved in uh, demonstrations. That's, that's to say that uh, we don't support the, the demonstrations at all, and also owing to our proximity to the city, we are part of uh, the larger communities doing businesses in Nairobi city. Uh, when you go to the CBD, when you go to Kikomba, when you go to Madare, when you go to all these areas where we have uh, hustlers doing their daily businesses, the Kamba community is more or less of a third of, uh, of the business people in Nairobi. And uh, owing to the demonstrations, our businesses have been disrupted, we have lost properties, our people have lost, and that's one of the reasons reason we are not in this demonstration because we can't ban business in Nairobi when uh, over a third of the businesses in Nairobi is owned by the Kamba community. So, as a community, we have come out and 